Diners, drive-ins, and dives. <laughs> Please state your name for the folks at home when I gesture toward you. Susan. Susan. Linda. Linda. Kevin. Kevin. Are you three related in any way? Yes. <laughs> Tell me, where are you from? Iowa. Iowa. How do you pass away the long evenings at home in Iowa? Uh, drink. Drink, really? <laughs> After you've had a couple of drinks, you start thinking to yourself, Hey, I've had a great idea. Let's dye our hair the same color. <laughs> Now, I'm guessing that there was some lady beauty treatments going on. You were a little buzzed up, and you're like... That's what happened, isn't it? You were like, oh, come on, then. Ah. Go for it. Yeah. That's how I got my breast implants. <laughs> so, uh, what do you guys do? Are you, uh, you, you're all um, living in the same house? We're married. You're married? Yeah. My sister from California. Oh, you're from California? I'm from Southern California. Oh, so your hair is naturally that color. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You moved to California? Yes. So you'll be the vegan liberal of the family. I am. <laughs> so, uh, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> so what part of Iowa do you live in? Des Moines. Des Moines, I've been there. Yeah. They've got that, uh, that, what's the name of that theater there? Civic, Civic Theater? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> don't. No, you, you don't go to the theater much, do you? No. Nah. Nah, nah. We had to pay to go there. Yeah, yeah. Let, me, let me guess. It was your idea to come here to this show tonight. It was, yes. Yeah. We couldn't get on Ellen. Yeah. Oh, right. That's fair. I mean, I can tell by your style you're drawn to that kind of a thing. Anyway, we're doing the Christmas card. I thought you guys would be great for oh. it. Sponsored by Just For Men. New Just For Men Auto Stop is foolproof. Gray is over. Ladies and gentlemen, Craig Ferguson. Nice audience. <laughs> They've made my nipples perky. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a great day for America, everybody. Well, now I see that. I see that, but actually, is it because the president of Iran is in New York City today? President Mahmoud, um, that guy, he's in. Uh, <laughs> He's visiting the UN. He's been in America one day and he's already passed Mitt Romney in the polls. That's unbelievable. 
The president, um, uh, 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 it was, uh, he was interviewed on uh, Piers Morgan's show. I can't believe CNN let that shady dude into the building and give him airtime. And also the president of Iran. <laughs> See, you see what I did, you knew I was going to do it, but you enjoyed it anyway. You knew I was going to do it, but you enjoyed it anyway. That's a double entendre. It means you knew I was going to have sex with you, and you enjoyed it anyway. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't start. All right, okay. Anyway, President Obama said he didn't have time to go to the UN today, but he did have time to tape an appearance on The View. Oh, 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 oh. That's true, he's like, oh yeah, the President runs there, I'm doing The View. <laughs> anyway, it was a tough interview for him on The View, though he faced a grilling from Barbara Walters. She was like, Mr. President, does Mitt Romney maybe hate you? <laughs> what was the deal with the Patriots last night? I mean, what? Now, if I seem like a bit, uh, if I've got a little bit of extra wind in my sails today, it's because the new Dancing with the Stars was just on earlier tonight, and I enjoyed it immensely. <laughs> I've got wind. I've also got wind in my sails because I've cut holes in my underpants. Anyway, the <laughs> Steve Mix. Doesn't mean you like that though. You smiled. I saw you smile. <laughs> That was definitely unprofessional of you. I said underpants and you went, mm, like that. Because I'm about to cut something myself. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, that was, you were saying, mm, that was a little bit. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I'm talk, can I talk about Dancing with the Stars? All right, that, even though it's not on this network, it's on ABC. You started, so. All right, then. So what I'm saying is I like dancing. Everybody loves Dancing with the Stars. Even Al-Qaeda loved Dancing with the Stars. They, they do. They're like, in their latest tape, they were like, Death to America, but only after we see Joy Fatou and Dance the Macarena. <laughs> I've said it a thousand times. Al-Qaeda actually invented the Macarena. <laughs> they did. They, they, you know, in that, that video, you see them, they're like, I'm the day, day, day. <laughs> Death to America, I... There are unconfirmed reports that Al-Qaeda also invented Gangnam Style. Oppa, Gangnam Style! Oh, yeah. Yeah, get with it, Grandma. That's what the kids are doing now. Oppa! Anyway, Dancing with the Stars is on ABC, but they actually tape it here in Television City. When I drive into the building, I see all the people lined up in their audience, and it's funny watching, they get all excited, they see me come in the, the you know, the artist's entrance, and then they go, ah. Oh. <laughs> It's a bit like the audience here, actually. Like, oh, yeah! Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> anyway, the se this season's Dancing with the Stars is called the All Stars Edition. Now, in previous years, people have complained that they've never heard of the stars. Well, not this year. This is the All Star season, and they've all been on before. They've got really the, the real big names. They've got Sabrina Bryan, Melissa Rycroft, Giles Marini. <laughs> yes, Giles Marini! They've got him or her. Not, not the Giles The Marini. Giles Marini, yeah! You're like, Giles Marini, you're like, Oppa, Giles Marini! <laughs> just because, look, just because I've never heard them doesn't mean they're not big stars. And in theory, they'll be better dancers because they've been on the show before. But I don't know if that works. I've done like a gazillion episodes of this show. Look at me, I still like it. <laughs> you got a picture of this year's cast? There you are, Dancing with the Stars. Wait a minute, who's that down at the bottom next to Pamela Anderson? What's going to, what the? That's me and Larry King doing jazz hands. <laughs> well, I, I, <laughs> I'm doing jazz hands. Larry's having an episode of some kind. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I would never be a contestant on that show unless they asked me. But most of them, <laughs> most of the people are from TV, except Pamela Anderson. She's a movie star. I've seen her movie, that movie where... <laughs> Look, I, that's a real movie, I saw it! I saw it, it's the movie where Tommy Lee drove a boat with his penis. That's true! It's true! He, he, they were stranded at sea, he's like, don't worry, I got it, foot bomb! And he went like I tried that once, I tried that once. I tried steering a boat with my penis, got me kicked out of the pool at the YMCA. 
Like, that's the worst thing that happened at the YMCA pool. <laughs> anyway, the members of the cast of the, uh, this year, the dance, uh, the, they've got um, Sabrina Bryan. I told you, she's a star on the Disney Channel. I've never seen a show, but I'm sure it's uh, peppy and upbeat. Not like the kids' show I watched growing up in Scotland, all that kind of, it's raining and we're gonna die. <laughs> A, B, C, D, oh, what's the point? <laughs> twinkle, twinkle, it doesn't even twinkle. <laughs> Dancing with the stars. Here's a tip. Uh, ladies, guys who are good at dancers are also good in bed. With other guys, admittedly. But they... <laughs> and there are uh, versions of Dancing with the Stars all over the world. In Britain, it's called Come Dancing. <laughs> That's what it's called. That is what it's called. You Google that. Google it. Right, you Google it. That's what it's called. Come Dancing, it's called. Yeah. Yeah. In Spain, it's called Let's Dance, and in Germany, it's called uh, Dancing Poopin'. <laughs> that one I made up. I think it's called Dance or You Will Die. <laughs> Dude, this is true. The German philosopher Friedrich Nietzsche said, uh, Nietzsche or Nietzsche, I don't know. It's like clitoris clitoris. I never know what to say. <laughs> Nietzsche, Nietzsche, what is it? Nietzsche? No, who the hell cares? Yeah, right, okay. <laughs> well, Nietzsche said, I would only believe in a God that knows how to dance. That's a well-known quote. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> but what's not so well-known is that Nietzsche himself loved to dance. Really? Do we have a picture of Nietzsche on a typical Saturday night? There he is, that's it. <laughs> What doesn't kill you will only make you dance, 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 dance. Opa, Gangnam Style. Gangnam oh, Style. Oh, 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 Opa, yeah. Gangnam Style. Gangnam Style. Hey, wait a minute, what? that's not Gangnam Style. What's that? No, that's Gay Man Style. <laughs> well, I, I'm gay. It's all right, Emily. All right, all right. Yeah. You want to... Uh... Sure, I'd love to. <laughs> Tonight's program is brought to you by the outrageous game that is everyone dancing, dance and pooping, dance, dance in your pants, yeah. Uh, Jeff and I have decided we're going to dye our hair to platinum blonde, right, Jeff? Yeah, yeah. We're going to get together. I've, I'm going to dye this hair platinum blonde. Where, 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 what hair have you got? <laughs> yeah. I have to tell you, before we get, last week, Jeff, you know that CBS started putting Beth, the network executive, on the floor, uh, standing next to Michael, so that to keep an eye on us, keep, you know, make sure that we're not, like, going too far. Oh, yeah. The audience have, uh, you know, people have been writing, and they're very upset. They're very, they don't like it. <laughs> they, feel, they feel that Beth is in some way, you know, slowing me down and, and you know, getting me to behave properly. And I'm like, strudel. No. <laughs> and I, it's a slang word, Beth. It's a slang word. <laughs> and uh, they said, you know, they, the whole idea is that, you know, we've got to streamline the show, make it a little more, you know, CBS, a little more broadcast friendly. Yeah. And uh, not so much in the way of sexual innuendo or, you know, cuss words and stuff. <laughs> but I have to tell you, you look... What's that coming to go? Hot tonight. <laughs> Baby. Look, I can't... I'm sorry, I'm a passionate man. I cannot keep inside me what I know to be true. I look at you and I'm like, damn. <laughs> might be a painted TV clown to you, sure, but inside these pants beats a thunderously impressive penis. <laughs> I think she's having a great time with it, don't you? A, a penis that can steer a boat, no less. Why do you have to make it so hard? <laughs> <laughs> That's great! You're helping! You're helping! 
What time is it, Jeffrey Pierce? It's street mail time. Time to take advice from a man who thinks ballroom dancing is swaying while wearing loose-fitting boxers. <laughs> Let's do our own jingle. Sure, All right. Email tweets and tweets. <laughs> 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 This is from Madeline in Philadelphia. You ever been to Philadelphia? Oh, yeah, you go to the place beautiful, area, beautiful swimming, swimming there. Moby, yeah, Moby Dick. Balls. Uh, <laughs> that's usually what you say. Yeah, yeah, I made a Moby Dick reference. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, dear Craig, are you really bringing GP to Radio City? Because that would be the most amazing addition ever to your show. P.S. I already have tickets. Can you wave to me? Uh, uh, <laughs> yes, Jeff and I, well, I'm going to Radio City Music Hall. Uh, when is it? It's on the 6th of October. 6th of October. Bukele to avoid disappointment. And uh, Jeff is... Are you going to be there? Yeah, I'll be there. I'll be Backstage. <laughs> no, no, I'll be there. You'll actually be there. Yeah, 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 not for much of it, though. No. I, yeah, all right. <laughs> this is from Lucas in Bonn, Germany. Oh, Germany! We have to read it in German accent. Oh, hello. Oh, yes. Hello. Hey, what do they say in the German nightclubs when you and I walk into the club, Jeff? Say, Here comes, comes the a player. player. Here comes, Here comes the player. player. Ooh, 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 they are so exciting. <laughs> Here comes the player. Oh, that's it. Okay, this is from Lucas in Bonn, Germany, who says, Dear Craig und Jeff, <laughs> would you ever consider doing a show in Germany? I know many people who would love you to. <laughs> well, if... We are receiving this uh, correspondence from you, and perhaps we are already somehow reaching Germany? <laughs> yeah, I think our show there is called Dance and Poopen. If you are just tuned in and you are watching in the United States of America, you're maybe you are not understanding because I'm speaking German. <laughs> I learned it from old movies. <laughs> correct, Jeff? That is correct. Mm -hmm. Here comes the players. Here comes a player. This is from Ralph in Shreveport, Louisiana, who says, uh, Dear Craig and Jeff, uh, Jeff. <laughs> wow, I'm even starting to talk like Ralph. <laughs> Dear Craig and Jeff. Can someone explain to me how the Saints are zero to three? I don't get it. Well, here's what happens. What happens is you, uh, you suspend your coach. You take, the, you take the smartest mind in football and you say, don't you get involved. <laughs> I'm no sports expert, but that seems to me unwise. <laughs> Does that seem fair? <laughs> We're out of time. Uh, so we'll just do a couple more. Yeah, all right. All right. Uh, dear Craig and Jeff, my roommate doesn't like it when I have people over. She gives me dirty looks in the morning, but I don't really think she gets the vote. What do you think? Don't care. Uh, <laughs> this is from Jeremy in Buffalo, New York. Everybody in Buffalo, well, New York. Right, right, right. Hi, Craig and Jeff. People make fun of me because I drive a crappy car. So they should. Uh, <laughs> Finally, this is from Joseph in Rapid City, South Dakota, who says, Hey, Craig and Jeff, after watching a show last week, I've decided I think Beth, the CBA exec, exec, is very hot. Is she single? Are you single, Beth? I will answer him personally after the show. Yeah, uh, he's a looker too, baby. Look at that. <laughs> well, you know a guy called Jeff in South Dakota or something? I can't even remember what it is. What was it? What Who the hell cares? <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you, know, we shouldn't, we, you know what we should make fun of Beth for? Not because she's trying to do her job properly, but because she drives a crappy car. I'd actually like that. That'd be better than what making me the butt of every joke. You're not the butt of every joke. <laughs> You're here, you're doing a job, and you're, listen, I, res I respect that you've got a tough job. <laughs> Dad, see, no, come on, man. No, and what, and what a fine butt it is. <laughs> and we come full circle. We'll be right back, everybody. We'll right back.
first guest tonight is a great big movie star. He's in a new series uh, called Vegas, which... Oh, man. Oh, man. Dennis Quaid, everybody. Dennis Quaid. Dennis. Dennis. Yeah. You're going crazy. crazy. I sometimes do. Wow, yeah. that's that is really badass. You and you walk it. Your jeans are ripped. What the hell, man? <laughs> <laughs> you, you've gone completely punk. Uh, <laughs> you know, it's only for the show. Yeah, but you, I'm a pacifist. That's what guys who are really badass always say. Just before I you just, kick your ass. I, yeah. Yeah, I know. <laughs> So you gotta do you gotta do a show like this, and then now like no matter where I go, somebody's gonna want to try to kick my ass. Well, see, no, I have that, but that's because I'm European. But the the uh, <laughs> do, are you a fighter? Have you trained to fight? Are you? Uh, I boxed in uh, when I first came out here the, really? at the Hollywood YMCA. Really? While you were in the pool. Yeah. I, <laughs> well, I'm that's going right. Boxing. <laughs> I was taking my boat around. <laughs> but, Boxers. Hello. Well, I never hit below the belt. Yeah, I yeah, can yeah. tell you that. So. Do you uh, do you still box? I mean, box is a great uh, workout. Man. Uh, it is a really good workout. Yeah, no, I'm uh, I've been cycling lately. Oh, yes, <laughs> road biking around the well, the well, city. What, what the hell is that? <laughs> do you get? Do you, do, you, do you wear lycra? Those little signals you give to cars so they won't yeah, hit yeah, you. Yeah. Yeah, please don't hit me. No, no. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going over here. <laughs> do you do you wear lycra? I. What is lycra? It's like it's like spandex. It's oh, a yes, brand I, name. Yeah, you got to wear that so yeah. people know that you're. Well, it's the bright colored, tight fitting yes, clothing. So they can see you. Yes. Are you wearing it now? <laughs> Want to see? No. A little okay. bit, actually, okay. a little Absolutely. bit. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, tell me about the the. You're working at CBS. I'm working awesome. at CBS. Yeah. We both have the same boss now. <laughs> Are they? Are they being? Are they, are they, They're they being good great. They've been great to us. Yeah. They, we'll, yeah. We'll see how that goes. Doing a show, it's called. Yeah. <laughs> well, you've been here longer than I have been here a long yes. time. They, 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 they take me for granted now. Yes. Yeah. I, I, if they know I'm here, which they don't. Uh, <laughs> the. Um, so tell me about the show, Vegas. Where, where's it set? It's, <laughs> Zing. We actually shot in Las Vegas, New Mexico. Believe it or not. Is we Las turned Vegas, Las Vegas, New Mexico, into Las Vegas in 1960. Uh -huh. but now we've Las Vegas, Nevada. Yes. Right. But now we've completely rebuilt the set in Santa Clarita, California. We, right. we built Vegas as it was back then. Really? Because it, Vegas doesn't look like Vegas anymore. No, it doesn't. Yeah. It, well, yeah, yeah, it, and this, bit, if you know where to go. Yeah, you know. yeah. Do you ever spend any time? Are you a gambler? Yes, I do love the game of blackjack. Oh, you do? Yes. I see. Yes. Well, you better hope this series does well then. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Are you, you any good? I mean... No, sometimes I'm good. Yeah. Sometimes I'm not so What good. about the, the poker? Do you ever play poker? That's the big thing with the celebrities now. I'm not, I'm not the into, in, really into the Hold'em and Texas Hold'em thing. I like the faster games. Yeah. I, like I turn everything into an aerobic activity, so... Aerobic blackjack. Yes, that's yes. nice. It is good. That's a, that's a you, workout video I've, I've I want to see. I've got a video see. coming yeah. out on it, in fact, yes. That would be cool. Yeah. Where you like rub, mm -hmm. <laughs> double down, <laughs> split that time, spin, split that time, spin, 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 yeah, yeah. double down, <laughs> double down. <laughs> That's nice. So the Vegas show, you play? Are you playing a, a tough guy that goes nuts? Uh, I'm playing a uh, no. I'm playing a, a real guy. It was uh, Sheriff Ralph Lamb. He was the uh, sheriff of Las Vegas from 1960 to 1978. Uh, Whoa! He was a fourth generation rancher. Yeah, he's probably and, pretty uh, tough. I yeah, imagine. and it was he was sheriff of Las Vegas during a time when uh, when the mob really came in and yeah, they're, they're not there over. anymore. <laughs> Yeah. Actually, nice job, actually. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, they all went away. They ain't here no more. Yeah, they ain't here no more. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. He fell off the roof. Yeah, off no, the roof. No, no, no. They ain't here. They went over there. Actually, the corporation's pretty much running. Yeah. Uh, who runs the corporation? The monsters. Yeah. Yeah, it's, like, but, yeah, it's all right. It's a corporation <laughs> now. Don't, it's all right. But, um, actually, that was like Jay Leno there. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Oh, well, anyway, oh. so, 
So, so he was the sheriff. So, uh, so who's your? Uh, do, do you have a, a lady sheriff in this? Uh, no. Michael, there's Michael no, Chiklis. There's no. <laughs> no, he's the mobster. Yeah, I, I can see how that would work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That, I'm excited about this. Yeah. I think it's going to be good. It's basically cowboys versus gangsters. Yeah, I like that. You like it? Yeah. <laughs> Did you see the Cowboys versus Aliens movie? No, I missed that. That nah, wasn't great. And but we didn't take anything from that. No, no, so, I, 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 yeah. and you'd be right. You'd be right. No, except honestly. for the the word cowboy. We did take that. But well, that's not copyright. That's, you can use the word cowboy. Yeah. Right. Yeah, like it's like, how you doing, cowboy? You're like, ooh, yeah. hi, cowboy. Like that. You can say that. Yeah. And you can say it any number of different ways. Like, yes. ooh, look, a cowboy in the yeah. swimming pool at the YMCA. Yeah. Whatever you want. Wow. <laughs> look, he's doing the cowboy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, we're out of time here, Dennis. Uh, uh, can I offer you a selection of... Uh, you can help yourself from our fruit oh, basket here. Absolutely. Uh, what, what would you care for? I got, oh, I got some see. clementines. I got a pomegranate here. Uh, the kiwi uh, was... Kiwi? This is a kiwi. It is a kiwi. I, I, it's the closest we can get to a kumquat without getting censored. Uh, right. right. Uh, I don't know what... What the hell is this? Um, what, what is what that? What is that? I don't know. It looks good, though. Looks like a, a lady coconut. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lady coconut. It is. And one day she'll meet a gentleman coconut and they'll have little peanuts. Yes. Well, that's nice. Uh, this as well. Look at that. What the hell is that? That, um... That's like that's a... a, that's a, a Freddy Krueger fruit, I think. <laughs> Freddy Krueger fruit? Great. Freddy Krueger fruit. Freddy, Freddy Krueger fruit still works in Vegas. Say that three times. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Freddy Krueger fruit. Um, all right, well, uh, that worked out, I think. Um, I, hear you do a I hear you do a great Clinton, by the way. A great what, Clinton? Yeah. Oh, no, you did a great Clinton in that thing. No, no my I've heard you do it. No, I do Italian Clinton. Well, let me just hear. What's the coming to go? <laughs> well, I can do that, too. Me piace il servicio in camera. Oh, nice! That was great, everybody. I'm right back. Dancing with the stars, my ass. <laughs> Dancing with the fake horse and eyeshadow, that's what Americans want. <laughs> Some Americans. <laughs> the creepy ones. <laughs> you. <laughs> my next guest is <laughs> Ellie Camper, everybody. Well, that's because of the people back there. But Who, Dennis Quaid? Much. Yes, Dennis, Dennis Quaid. Dennis Quaid. He was like, let me Dennis get the... Quaid. <laughs> <laughs> Put everything just in order and poof. No, that's because of what they transformed. When I came in, I didn't no, look very No, yeah, I think you look fantastic. Oh, that's nice. No, you're well, really, really, thank you. really you're, good. You're, so do you. You, look, you always look good. You look very youthful. Why, why, well, why are we making this about me? This is know. not about I me. I don't know. <laughs> why do you, you have a problem with me complimenting you? It's making you a little uncomfortable. I should I just see. accept it. I should just accept it. You, you, thank you. Yeah, thank you. You, look, you look great. I got married. Maybe that's why. Well, that clearly the regular sex agrees with you. <laughs> The sanctioned, yes, the, 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 yes, yes. The, the regular sex sanctioned by society and the church of your choice, yes. I'm sure. Yes, yes, any, any uh, church, church uh, choice. It gives you that warm feeling of you're not breaking the law and you're still having fun. <laughs> I love this 
new studio, by the way. Did you like it? Yeah, I like love it. It's it's, it's, I, I, it's it's spacious. It's gorgeous. You got a lovely lovely view. We didn't lose the view at all. No, uh, the view is still intact. Yeah, unbelievable. Yeah, we got the rhino head. Uh, yeah. I, it's, 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 I mean, um, the pitch. We got lovely pictures. Betty White, uh, oh my old gosh. Tom, God rest him, Justin Bieber, uh, Paul McCartney, Paul McCartney. Uh, <laughs> What was that? Pat Sajak. Pat Sajak. Yeah, do you know Pat Sajak? Pat this was his studio. I know it was. This was his, he had his very famous late night show from this studio. <laughs> I, first of all, I'm a, I am, look, I, I don't know Pat, Pat Sajak personally yet. Yeah, you probably will. I probably will. Yeah, yeah. But I'm a huge fan of Wheel of Fortune, among other things. So anyway. It what do you mean, among other things? Like what? Like <laughs> Chocolate. Chocolate, yeah, and, yeah. And, right. and, um, um, Sanctioned uh, <laughs> sex with yeah. your. Uh, I'm a huge fan of, of church sanctioned sex. Church sanctioned sex <laughs> and chocolate. Do you ever combine that? Wow. Yeah. Straight yeah, to the yeah, heart. Yeah. Straight to the heart. Straight to the heart. So, but are you enjoying this new space? Yes, part? I like it a lot. Yeah, I think it's haunted though. <gasps> Wait, I'm, I'm, after having said I'm like a, you know, well, I'm Catholic, whatever, but let's talk about like, wait, hold, you are, do you believe in spirits? Well, the, the, <laughs> so, something horrible happened here uh, uh, some time ago. And I'm not just talking about Patsy Jack's late night show. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it seems to be possessed with the evil spirit of corporate America. Oh! Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, nah, it, it's all right. It's all right. It's I know. No. You, 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 you do look great, though. You look fantastic. Oh, how, how have you again, been? How's the uh, uh, fine? Yeah? yeah, no, I mean, yeah. Um, uh, we we got married in New York. In we um, didn't, did we? Uh, <laughs> no, that'd be awkward because <laughs> I'm already married and I'm not Catholic. So there's two, you know. <laughs> Instant, like, yeah, yeah, I can't yeah, do yeah. that. And did you have a big wedding? Was it? Um, like... It was big ish. It was fine. It was like 200 people. I think that's, that's huge. Well, you're not. Nice. What, how big was your wedding? Me and my wife. Yeah, so yeah. That's... <laughs> but it was snowing. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean? So well, you mean we you were going to have this wedding, and then wait, 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 wait. This no. is about me again. This Should is not I about know? me. Okay. Okay. okay, all right. All right. We, we had the opposite of snowing. It was in July in New York, and it was so hot. I mean, obviously, who plans a wedding in New York in July? I don't. Uh, you. I do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, it was very hot. Is your husband from New York? No, but we met in New York, okay. so we're hopeless romantics. Oh. Okay. That... Anyway, we met. In New wait York. till you have kids. That'll disappear. <laughs> I know. Like the wind. Then it'll just be, all I really want is sleep, you bastard. I That's know. all it'll be. <laughs> I'm bringing a little of myself to this. No, uh, no, no. No, well, no, that, no, really, I'm not getting any sleep at all. I uh, can't, but, well. I just fell asleep right there. See, when I, I was know. looking at you, I was like. Tell me, how many hours, how many <laughs> You're a master of disguising. It. Yes, I, I'm going to have my eye, my <laughs> eyes tattooed on. on my eyes. Yeah. How much sleep do you get a night? Would you? Sleep? About 45 minutes. Oh yeah. no! And not all together. No. Yeah. Oh no! You know when you? I haven't had a child, so I, I, I don't pretend. I, I hate it when I try to sympathize with someone who's had a child. I'm like, I know about this sleep. No, no, you don't. You know, it's fine. You should just make sure you enjoy your life now, <laughs> because when you have kids. <laughs> in my head, mm -hmm. and I don't even want to say this out loud because now I hope it doesn't come true, especially now that I know this is Well, this show isn't technically out loud, but it's a try it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. But I will say that I have this, I'm like, eh, I haven't really envisioned my life past age 40. Like, I just haven't. Mm. So, but I know that there could possibly be 60 years after that. So I have to. Whoa. Yeah, all right. Oh, yeah, no, I'm going, I'm uh, going yeah, to 100. Yeah. Yeah. So I feel like, well, I should get an, an understanding of what will happen then. And what will happen is like a lot of sleepless nights. A lot of sleepless nights. A lot of pain. Uh, yeah, well, I, I'm 50 now. 50? Wouldn't ever believe that. Oh, not, see, not, not that 50 wait, is not... old. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. No, no, what I'm saying is you look fantastic at any age. <laughs> I said everything wrong. No, no, it, it's great. Yeah, it's great. Really, I appreciate it. No, but no, he's... So I have a phone asleep again. <laughs> No, no, no. It, things do, do change as you get older. It's, you know, it's like I never envisaged myself making it past 28. Real, well, but... Yeah, yeah. You and have, I don't think anyone have, who knew me at that point would have, said, would have said, yeah, 28 is about <laughs> right. Yeah, uh, but no, it's a whole different thing. There's doctors and things. Yeah, no. I have, um, um, my grandpa is 92, and he um, often tells me about... <laughs> the olden days? Well, the olden days and, and his... His business. <laughs> well, 
when you get past 90, you can be as rude as you want and everybody that's, thinks I, it's cute. You know, it's and like, I think people like play that to oh, the max. Oh, sure. Yeah. When, if I make it to 90, I'll be like, my balls are hanging all over the place. People are like, ah, oh, Grandpa, you're so cute. Like, do you want to see a photograph of my penis? Yeah. Here's my penis in Florida. Grandpa. He's so cute. He's a dog. Yeah. No, I know. But I do think some people play that up. And, so, and you apparently, I think, maybe. I, maybe I, I went too early. I, I've been doing it now. <laughs> How old are you? Well, 50, yeah. No, no, 50. you are 50. But I mean, you're, anyway, oh, yeah. too personal. Okay, I was going to ask. How old my penis? My penis is the same age as me. <laughs> Ageless, ageless. It's, no, no, it's it's certainly <laughs> feeling the, the clock. <laughs> but, but. <laughs> oh, God. Are you talking about penis? Yes! Who it's hell, it's health it? conscious. Yeah, right, exactly. Very yeah. good. Oh, we're out of time. Um, oh. <laughs> so, how's the show this year? Good? Oh, this show's great. Great. <laughs> uh, so, uh, you want a piece oh, of fruit? Yes, yes. Um, okay. I think we found out what this is called. What's it called again? Uh, what's it best? What's it called? Ma Mamie? The other one. Ma uh, you, you're best now. You're best now. <laughs> this is a uh, this is a uh, this is a lady coconut. <laughs> oh, I like coconut. And you, know, I you know how? You know, no, 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 no. What? Say it. I was going to say. You know how you can tell it's a lady coconut? And how? I'm not going to say. Oh it. no. No, because, well, you know, some women still enjoy this show, and I don't want to piss them off any more than I already am. All right, so you got a, you want a, one of these? These are awesome. You talk to me about this. Well, this is a pomegranate, and you can also oh, use them to, oh. as a tool. <laughs> a screwdriver. Yeah. Oh, I like a pomegranate. Well, there you are, then. And also... Um, oh, you go shopping? What else do you want, then? <laughs> I, sorry if you've been through this. Which one? That's a reptile fruit. It's, uh, <laughs> it's made of re reptile. I do not want that one. I will. Do you want this one? <laughs> or is it the same? Is it just the same but a different? Yeah, like, it's the same but different. <laughs> yeah. Maybe I'll have that and an orange. All right, then. Or now put them uh, both in one hand. Awesome. It was pretty adorable, the cat tap dancing. <laughs> uh, I learned that uh, we went too long tonight and we're, the show's running approximately three minutes over. I'd like to apologize to the network, I'm really sorry. Uh, but it was just one of those things. One of those, what did we say again, Jeff? One of those crazy uh -oh. things. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good night. Good night. <laughs>